So Staffy ended up taking it in that semis game over to Sosa. Uh, technically getting the upset simply yeah. because Sosa's been taking so many tournaments. Yeah, it, it, it's definitely an upset. So this match has happened several times, many, many times throughout history. I Punch Kids has always won. Has it? Yeah. It actually happened earlier today in winner's bracket, so they're getting the rematch yeah. here. In this has already happened today, even. It's happened yesterday, I think. <laughs> it might have. Uh, it happens all the time, regardless. And That's funny. It, it's always really close, but uh, I Punch Kids always clutches it. I think today might be the day. We'll see. That was an excellent performance from Stoppy that last game. So. Yeah, that was definitely like the best I've seen Stoppy play. I Punch Kid's already dead through some mystery that I didn't see because I didn't expect him to die that percent, so I wasn't looking. Yeah. Um, this is bringing, he's bringing it back really quickly. Yeah, he's got a huge damage build up on Stoppy right now, but He's at least getting a little extra for credit. Lucario did is a really fun to watch. Very back and forth. It's interesting. There All it right. Is. So it's even to back up. I think, like, I think anything up to 90% is an even game between these two. Yeah, I agree. Maybe I a little like earlier, say. just because it's Smashville and that platform could result in early kill. Maybe. Yeah. But the potential for zero to death is certainly there. Absolutely. All right. Wow. He hits him backwards. That was the only way to kill him. That was really good. Yeah. He had that nair. I don't know if that was intentional of him because that looks like it hit him. Like he did center. get on that side just at the last second, so it's hard to say, but it definitely worked out for him. Stoffy in the slight lead. It won't be long now until a nair or any smash attack will kill Stoffy. And that'll not do it. But I believe the next one will. Stoppy just carrying that momentum over. I lied to, to everyone. That did not work. <laughs> I, said, <laughs> I said the next one would. The next one will, right? I can't be wrong three times. There we go. There it is. There, uh, Lucario has this special ability on this stage to recover or gain aura off of the, the balloons. Luca uh, Ivysaur used to be able to recover off of them but no longer can. That was removed in the uh, 3.5 update. It didn't really make much sense for him to be sapping life from things that weren't alive at all. Right, but now you can still heal off of invincibility. Yeah, you can heal off anything that is alive. Which right. includes players and pretty much just waddle these and waddle do's. Now what about the uh, obvious secret character everybody's talking about adding villagers, trees. Those are alive. Not kidding. Oh, yeah. So, Stoffy's looking like the winner of game one to me. I Punch Kids' punish game is remarkable, but um, this is just quite a bit to come back from. This yeah. requires so few mistakes in neutral, and as I said, Stoffy's see, he seems to me to be the better player in neutral, so I didn't see it happening. Right in the back, right away. Not a second thought. Stoffy takes game one, though. I Punch Kids loves this level. He also just ran it back really quickly. I Punch Kids is appalled at the idea of losing to Stoffy. I think if Stoffy takes this game, he's taking the set because I think it'll get in uh, I Punch Kids' head. Yeah, I agree. It, uh, these two have had a bit of a rivalry, mostly on I Punch Kids' end. He's a very competitive person. He's been known to like $100 money match or more, like every Lucario that he comes across. And so far, he's on a winning streak. There you go. The first Taking the first stock again. Yeah. A bit of a lead. Good sweet spot. Stop just running away with those momentum he has, and we've got another crowd gathered. Yeah, there's quite a crowd. Sort of all of them are kind of looking away, but uh, everyone's here. No one wants to miss it. All right, that's in there. Even game. Well, okay. All right. IPK coming back here. He has the lead for the first time. I think this set, actually. Oh my gosh. That was a really cool looking combo. It wasn't the best, but that was really cool. Almost finished that. That would have been really yeah. nice. I punch kids always goes for that, but lately, I feel like he needs to practice it because he's been missing a lot of those off the top kills. Well, 
Today, he's been pretty on point. He's only missed them, I think, this last couple games. Maybe this game, actually, mm -hmm. being the significant one. Ooh, that forward smash was so close to hitting. And if it did, you could bet that that would have taken the stock. All right, F-Punch Kids pulls further and further ahead. Can Stoffy get the, the combo he needs? And Edge Guard would be a good place to start. All right. I'm actually surprised we didn't see a Spirit Bomb there. That would have narrowed Stoffy's options. Yeah, Lucario players like to recover high quite often. So that could have been really good. He did not have a charge, so he died. One stock to two stocks, this is very hard. But definitely doable. It's like a spacey ditto, you know. It's, it's right. smash. Things can turn around. Actually, I would compare it more to a Falcon Ditto because touch of death. One of these guys is gonna hit the other oh, yeah. and has the potential to zero death. Up. Yeah, it's the, their potential is definitely there. There's an old melee video, uh, series of videos called uh, "You Must Recover." And I remember it, those. Yeah. Almost all, uh, not almost all. Many of those situations happen where you recover when you're not supposed to because the opponents. Uh, the opponent Faded. does something dumb. Like you, you attempt to recover when there is other when you cannot, and they try to hit you when they don't need to, and then you're able to come back because of that. Yeah, just never give up in Smash. Yeah. You could always come back. It's always possible. Best recovery. All right, that's gonna be an error. Game. Right, if game two goes to IPK. No run back. I don't know if that's Stuffy style. Never mind. Yeah. I take it back. It is Stuffy style. I think Stoffy should have thought about different stages, but I guess they both like it, so... I mean, they both won one here, so I can understand why yeah. you both of them think that this is a good choice. So that's something they both like to do, and it's an excellent mix-up. They both like to throw that side B grab out really early to continue a combo. The command grab is a great mix-up. So that was a brutal first stock. That lasted uh, uh, 19 seconds. That was good. Yeah. They were in each other's face the entire time. Mostly because uh, Stoffy was pinned to the ledge. He seemed yeah. like he wanted to escape a lot, but couldn't. I punch kids recovers high. The correct decision, considering I, uh, Stoffy was charging a down smash. There was no other way he would have lived. Ooh, this could be bad. Oh, they both make it back. Okay. I think after this stuff, he's probably going to reconsider a stage. Because yeah. this is definitely I Punch Kids' favorite level. It is showing. Yeah. That the momentum totally has shifted back, I'd say. I'd like to see Stoffy win one of these. Because I Punch Kids always wins, and it's always so close. It's one of those matches that you can tell one of these days it's going to happen. It's going to happen. A lot of players I fight who it's are. It's going to be exciting. Uh, yeah, who are very good, and I always beat them, but they're but it's always so close. And right. I know one of these days they're going to get me. <laughs> I'm just waiting until that day when they're playing super on point, and like the stars align and they, they end up killing me. But it'll happen. Not this me, because I'm not competing anymore. <laughs> yes, you have you have you have given it up for Lent for for generosity for, for the stream. You gotta get this content. It's important. Yeah. I play friendlies. I'll get on stream every once in a while. All right. So this is. This is over. Three stocks is nearly impossible. And it, honestly, if you get three zero deaths, it's possible. It's just there's, a little, there's a little silent moment there. Yeah. And that's down beat in there. Kills him. There's been a lot of stocks taken today. There has. In, in this set especially. All right, they're running it back. I Game guess. four. I don't agree with this decision at all. They're both stubborn, I think. Yeah, I can see that. Life I don't know much Lugar about Stoffy as a person, but I've spent enough time with my punch kids to know that he's very stubborn. Stoffy kind of looks like John Lennon. Yeah, he kind of does. Um, how long, how much of a clip can you play before it becomes copyright infringement? 30 seconds? I think every time Stoffy wins, I'm going to play a Beatles song. 30 seconds. <laughs> that was fun. Alright, even game. 
Okay, Staffy just keeps happening to him. He keeps getting pinned at the ledge yeah. by up wrench kids, and this has cost him so much every single game. He needs to not get pinned at the ledge. High punch kids is like a mark, just cornering you there. Don't say that because he thinks the car has a bar syndrome. That's that's definitely not true. <laughs> no, I think he's changed his opinion on that. He said it one time, and everybody got on him for it. Yeah. Oh my gosh! How did that hit? It's got that range. The aura reaches really far. That surprised me. The forward smash is the same I way. I play Lucario like every single day. <laughs> I play one of these guys every day. That was shocking. The uh, neat thing about his forward smash, though, is the further away the aura hits you at, the more knockback it has. You know that? You should know that. Maybe. Maybe you know that. Yeah, I might know that. I might just not have told anyone. <laughs> Alright. So, like most sets that they play, Stoffy usually takes it early on in the set, but then I Punch Kids kind of figures them out. This is how it always goes. Yeah. This is the first time I've seen it. So I Punch Kids always takes the last game. Down there, really interesting choice. Definitely caught Stoffy yeah. off guard. Going onto oh, the stage, okay. styling him a I, bit there. I feel like that was a mistake. But you I mean, think? you might as well call it a style, you know? Yeah, hey. Might as well take credit for You it. can't tell because he doesn't change his expression ever. Yeah. Unless he's playing against K9 and then it just becomes a yelling match. Alright. Stompy's classic grab. His side B. Alright, this is, this is no longer possible. <laughs> I believe. If, when you watch this, just remember that I mean, Ravi believes in here. Like, uh, I believe me, it's, it's never over in Smash, but I think this is over. So I would bet money at this he point. He just power shielded the aura from, I think it was either a side B or a forward smash from Stoffy. Yeah. But it was power shield. There was a power shield sound. And yep, that's so going to be it. That's game, and we're going to see the rematch. All right, so game three, Larry that ditto again goes to IPK. We're going into grand finals here. We have Eye Punch Kids versus Larry Lur again. Stay tuned.